A quiet day today, a sunny day today in the Denver area. It ended very pretty with the high clouds coming in. This view from City Park, but those high clouds are the forerunners of the approaching storm system moving into the high country right now. This is what it looks like up in the mountains. This is the view just a few moments ago up at Beaver Creek where the snow is coming down. It's moving our way. Here's what radar shows at the moment. You can see that snow over the high country. Some rain showers farther down to the south around the Pueblo area and there are batches of dense fog out on the far eastern plains off into Kansas, Nebraska. The snow has reached Summit County coming down near the Continental Divide now to gradually work its way down the hill toward Denver, but we won't see anything for the next few hours in Denver right now. Partly cloudy 29 at DA 34 downtown pressure falling 29.50 winds from the east at seven wind chill at 22 degrees high Temperature today was at 54, 22 the low. The normals are 44 and 17, 68 and 20 below are the extreme. So this is the storm system for us tonight and tomorrow. It's not real strong. It's moving down toward the southeast, so it's mostly going to impact the mountains. Elsewhere in the country, this storm is spreading a lot of rain and thunderstorms across much of the Ohio Valley down to the Gulf Coast. It's going to bring rain to Washington, D.C. for the inauguration for tomorrow. In Colorado, we have just a little bit of snow developing late tonight here won't impact the morning drive too much because the roads are relatively warm. I think they'll mainly be wet. You might need a little bit of extra time, but not much. 28 for Denver tonight, 25 at Greeley, 14 at Leadville and at Gunnison. And along the front range, temperatures will be at or close to freezing in some locations around Boulder and Broomfield. So road surfaces should stay pretty warm into the early morning hours. But this is 6 a.m., a little mix of some uh, rain and snow along the front range. A few spots might have locally slick conditions on bridges and overpasses, but in general, the roads will be wet. The snow moves to the east of us, increases a bit in coverage. Mountains continue to pick up snow. We're not going to see a lot out of this for the Denver area. I think it traced to an inch at the most, an inch or so just to the east of us. Three to six for the northern mountains tonight, six to 12 expected tonight and tomorrow for the central and southwestern mountains. Highs tomorrow, still chilly, but not far from the normal for this time in January. 43 in Denver, 20s and 30s expected. The mountains front range numbers will mostly be in the low 40s, so what hits will melt pretty readily tomorrow in the afternoon. Forecast tonight, clouds increase at lower elevations. Mountain snow expected to continue, 28 for a low. Tomorrow we get that mix of a little bit of rain and snow, and then temperatures reach about 43. Heavy snow will continue, especially in the southwest mountains. Looking ahead, a fairly quiet weekend, low 40s Saturday and Sunday, periods of snow in the mountains. Monday, that snow increases in the mountains, and Tuesday is our first alert weather day. A stronger storm system coming in from the west will spread snow over the mountains, and at least a few inches of snow down here. Colder temperatures with a high around 32. Okay, so tomorrow might be a little little fun, but not bad. Yeah, tune us in yeah. early at 4.30 or 5 or 5.30, whatever you get up and <laughs> check it out. Check it out yeah. in the morning. Thank you, Mike. Okay.